Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> this is a hero's engine. It is a hero's engine, an ancient engine, right? The whole history of hero's engines and how to make them at home. Hey, welcome once again to Faraday Studios, home of Midnight Science Club. I'm Jake Wizard 4, and I have three wits with me today. This is Elliot, this is Ethan, Godwin the physics major. And what do we know about Godwin? Can we trust him? No. No, no. he's sneaky. All physics majors are sneaky. I was a physics major, I know this. I reached back into this activity, a physics activity from Alexandria. You've heard of Alexandria, the ancient city. Alexandria, Egypt? Yeah. What is that? Well, that is the question. I just want you to look at that thing. My question, yes. Does it? Is it supposed to hold something? Oh, yes. I'll tell you that right there is an alcohol amp. This is called a Hero engine, H-E-R-O, natural philosopher. And before there was a science, there were people called natural philosophers. And that is an alcohol burner, which I think we've got some alcohol in it already. And they would put water, where do you think they would put water in? There. In, the, in there. Describe what you think, Godwin. Well, the heat would turn the water into steam. Yeah. Well, let's see if we can get this thing uh, fired up. Squirt some water in there. I think if that's water, it might be nitric acid. Gotta be careful. You ready? We're ready. Hey, in case you had an accident, everybody say goodbye, Ethan. Goodbye, Bye, Ethan. Ethan. Yeah, we're cooking. Do whatever you're supposed to do. There it goes. Oh, there, oh, look at this, look at this. Oh, look at, you see the little steam yep. going? You see them going? It's starting to go. Oh my gosh. You see the little steam coming out of yep. there? Yep. It's going faster and faster, faster. I think. It's going faster, it's getting hotter. Man, we're getting, we're getting ahead of steam on there. Come on, baby, go. Well, we've got some other hero engine models. We're gonna bring them over here. Got some interesting questions. So we went upstairs into the storeroom and found some more heroes engines we had here. Now, do you see any similarity between that one? Okay, well that, I'm guessing would be that. Yeah. This Bunsen burner would be yeah, the alcohol the, the lamp. alcohol lamp. And the holder thing would be this. And what about the little, what, are, what would you call these things? The jets. The jets. The jets are here. Okay. And they can still, and they can still So what, is that, what are those jets made out of? Um, I'm guessing a copper, I believe. Copper tube. Yeah. So now we can kind of see what's going on inside, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Shall we see if this one works? Sure, yes. yeah. Now I want you to move it around just a little bit like this. Whenever you heat up a, a cold piece of glass, right. you, don't, you don't want to heat it just straight up like that. You want to right. kind, of, kind of warm it a little bit. Hey, honey, I got some heat here for you. You don't want to shatter that, do we? No. They call it thermal shock. If you just heat up one spot. Okay, Look guys. at this. We have a hero's engine. It's getting faster. Oh, sweet. There are a lot of steam engines, but that's probably one of the most primitive steam engines. A hero's engine. Hero of Alexandria. You think it's the steam that's trying to get out that's pushing that thing forward? The ones with outputs is those copper ends. At the end. So that little steam molecule that's coming out pushes on that thing as it goes out. See you later, I'm out, and he gives it a shove. When it goes, that little steam molecule that comes flying out the end of that tube. There is pressure inside that whole container, right? It's pushing on the glass, it's pushing on this copper, and it's pushing out. There's pressure pushing everywhere, right? But where it's going out the hole, straight across from that, the steam is hitting on the pipe, and that's the steam that's pushing that around. The internal steam pressure in there is what's pushing that thing forward. And it's imbalanced, that's why it's burning. If it was balanced, it wouldn't be moving, but it's imbalanced. And here's, a, we got another Heroes engine that we found upstairs. Ooh, that's a sweet looking, Mama, look at that thing. How would you fill this with water easily? Well, if you stuck this end in like a bowl of water and then sucked on that end like a straw. You watch that and let me, t you tell him when, it, look at it. Tell him when to yeah. stop. Let's stop right there. Look at you, man. Look at that, look at that. That was sweet, that's a neat one. Okay, think you got it warmed up up there? You better get out of the way. You know, I'm, you know, I'm not sitting in line with one of those spinners. There, there it goes. Man, that that just scared me to death. That Anybody got paper off, towel? all at once, and then it yeah, just stopped. Does it, yeah, look at that. Well, oh, that was a thing. It gave up a warning. <laughs> I said, stand back, idiots. Ooh, the bottom's hot and the top's cold. So it starts up and it is like an old car starting. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! <laughs> Did you see that? I'm glad you caught that on camera. This is a charge. What, thing. getting the wizard jump back? Like? <laughs> yeah, that scared me. Did that scare you? Yes. Yeah, I did. I made me jump. So what I want to do is send you off and see if you can build 
with some junk you find in the studio here. Build your own hero's engine. So we're back. Let me see what you made. So that's a hero's engine. You have multiple holes on the can, right? Mm -hmm. What is this thing here? What is that? Fishing. Oh, a little spinner from a fishing. Yeah. Yes. Oh, sweet. So let's fire yours up and see what happens. So what's going on inside the can now? Hopefully the water will be starting to boil. Water will be starting to boil. I see it. Oh yeah, it's starting. Look at that, there it goes. Oh my goodness. Oh, that's not bad at all, buddy. No. Oh, I did that, that on purpose. Hey, oh. oh yeah, look at this. Oh. I did that on purpose so it would do that. Well, oh, look, it's an automatic plant sprinkler. Yeah. Yes. You see, this is quite in the water. See, it's got to run a little smoother. That's well, awesome. there we go. We've got the same. Yes. Now, same sprinkler. sprinkler. All right, let's give this man a hand. He did all right. He made his hero's engine. So do you think, physics major, what did you come up with for your hero's engine model? Well, instead of using aluminum cans, I yes. decided to go with a full-on aluminum square box. A square box. Are we ready, Godwin? Yep. Okay. Everybody say goodbye, Godwin. Bye, Godwin. Oh, it's putting out some noise, that can. It's vibrating like a drum. It's coming. I that, see it. Oh, oh. It's going. Godwin, it's actually going to. I, Godwin, I'm proud of you. Look, we got a two cylinder with just two holes. You guys had five or six holes. He's only got two. This looks like something from NASA. Go faster. Makes you want to make one. I'm so excited. I could just have it fit, can you? Mm -hmm. We used all the gas. <laughs> Sorry. It's a good place to quit. Look at the camera and say goodbye. Goodbye. Thank you. That was kind of cool. Mm -hmm. Hero's engine.